right guys uh hope everybody's having a great saturday night uh so i decided that i was going to download this uh demo of an alien abduct abduction game called they are here i think it was it came out in july ish the demo did um so basically what i know about it it's a uh, first person horror game uh where you're a journalist and i believe you witness an alien alien abduction on the gray's wood farm um the pretty much the object of the game is to explore the the farm and the barn and everything to take pictures and find evidence showing um alien and paranormal activity and to find out exactly what happened on the farm uh this game is set to release in early 2022 so with that being said let's uh let's check out this demo and see what this is all about here hope for no alien probes okay. so, of august 7th the sherman family witnessed bright lights in the sky that moved at a breakneck speed over the cornfield naturally the lights moved in a random direction and at, a dif and at different speeds. After a while, they vanished. This was strange behavior in the sky, or this strange behavior in the sky was observed at the same time each night for five nights. Hmm. Sounds fun. According to the owner of the farm, all the animals went crazy. The dog became aggressive, tried to attack him and bite him, or it bit him. The children complained that someone was walking under their windows. Farmer Peter Sherman himself in the field saw a strange figure that did not look like a man. What is it? Deliberate deception? Drawing attention to oneself? Or a sensation about an alien invasion? Journalist Taylor Fox travels to Grayswood Farm to take photo and make reports for the local newspaper. Mm -hmm. Sounding good so far. Your typical alien abduction story. Already there and out of the vehicle. Alright, talk to Farmer Peter Sherman. Task number one. Nice little retro news van there. Okay. I'm liking the way this is looking so far. Oh shit. Headlights blinking. Kinda wanna get back in the van and just go now. Oh. Oh. First video there. Or picture, video, Jesus. Nothing, nothing creepy about that at all. All right, moving right along here. Yeah. Hmm, wonder what's in the trash bag. Hopefully not the Sherman family. I'm liking the way this is looking. Children running out anywhere. Uh, hopefully that was me stepping on something. Maybe not. Okay. And moving right along. <laughs> I'm not ready to see an alien yet. Always the ass light. Okay, I guess I can't go that way. Um, let's go ahead and go in the house first. Oh, got a note. <clears throat> let's see. Holy crap, that's hard to read. Oh, I guess I'll go over here. <laughs> oh. Mr. Fox, we made an appointment, but something bad happened. Our daughter went missing. My wife went to town for help. My son and I went to check out the farm. We'll leave notes for you and the police in case we pass each other. Be careful, P Peter Sherman. Okay. Inspect the house. Nothing ever bad happens there. Oh, can we call? Oh! A little staticky. I do not want to phone home. get in there? No. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Well, well. What do we got here? 
mystery sky object seen here. This old newspaper has information about UFOs and crop circles. Okay. Leave a milk sitting out, that's not good. Uh, let's go upstairs. Let's see what we got going on up here. <clears throat> You got the window? No? Okay. Hmm. Look over there, son. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna go somewhere with that, but we'll stop there. Oh, that doggy. How cute. <clears throat> oh, open the door up in my face. Ow. Farmer's note. I learned a lot about these things. They are called the greys. They are not little green men, but big, creepy, and dangerous creatures. Basically, they can be described in the following way. A large head, disproportionate to the body, no hair, bottomless black eyes, gray skin, long thin, lim long, thin limbs. Their faces are like nothing else. These aliens are very aggressive towards people. It all starts with bright lights in the sky near home which move along a certain way, then people start to have <clears throat> a nosebleed, have severe headaches, and a buzz in their ears. Which sounds like a normal Saturday night. Uh, when they come back to the normal, they find themselves in unexpected places. For example, in the middle of a field or on a road a few kil kilometers away from home. And I'm sure their assholes are hurting too. Anal probe joke there. Some of them have flashbacks and terrible memories. People remember terrifying experiences. The anal pro. The anals, uh, the anals, Jesus Christ. The aliens established control over their minds and this has affected their psyche. Also, they found the marks on the body, incisions to be exact. During palpation, it felt like something thick, like a foreign object moving under the skin. That's what she said. This sounds like, um, sounds like a good time. It's like a very lumpy bed, Jesus. Look at this. Uh, your typical big eyed alien. Ugh, it's creepy. Ah, uh, a photo from the internet. Perhaps Peter Sherman saw something similar. It looks creepy. That's what I said. Ooh, glowing eyes. Ew. A face only a mother can love. Alright. Children's diary. Found my old diary from when I was 15 years old. How could I forget that? Today was the most exciting and scariest day of my life. I saw the aliens. My parents think I'm lying, but it's true. I was fishing from an abandoned pier on the river. Suddenly I was deafened by a roar coming from behind. I turned around, very low above the ground, a huge disc with four flashing lights or windows was hovering. I felt a punch that seemed to throw me into the air. I froze there <clears throat> as if in zero gravity. Everything around me became blindingly bright and I seemed to lose consciousness. I remember seeing three aliens with gray skin and big eyes. I was placed in, on the table as if I was welded to it. They were standing over me. It seemed to me that they communicated with each other telepathically. That'd be handy. Then one of them came over and did something to my head. I don't remember anything else. I woke up on the pier later in the evening and barely made it home. My head was buzzing and I walked home as if in a delirium. When I got there, I found several cuts on my body and two small, very smooth holes behind my ears. What was that? I'm scared to sleep. All right, let's call this photo of that. Can I see out the window? Anything in here? Nope, not a damn thing. Digging the music. Setting the tone for some creepy shit to happen. 
Okay, so I think. Ah, uh, must be a little kid's room here. <clears throat> that sounds, uh. Yeah, listen closely, you can hear very strange sounds. Uh, yeah, I get that. That's creepy as shit. Let me walk over here and look around before I look out the window. Oh, look! The alien came to visit her prior to abducting her. It looks like this drawing was made by the missing daughter of the farmer. The paper is painted on both sides. Oh. Oh, oh no! It killed the dog! Why are they always gotta fuck with the dog? Fucking aliens? Jesus Christ. Alright, another note. This is my daughter's room. Figured that. During the night I heard a strange noise when I came in. She wasn't in her bed and the window was wide open. I'm sure she was abducted by those things. I mean... Uh oh. What is that? What is that? Oh my god! Take that. 
I'll take your nasty neck implant. Sure, let me take the implant the aliens implanted in this guy and carry it around when there's aliens around. Maybe they, they'll track me. What the fudge? Alright, god dang it, man. I might cry like a little girl. I am, I am actually a little freaked out. I'm not even gonna fucking lie. It's my flash. Uh, oh, they knocking shit over. All right, assholes, you killed the dog. <coughs> ah, shit. <laughs> mm, that was that fucker walking by. Okay. You know what? Let's just, uh, let's go see if they're friendly. Apparently they don't like dogs. Oh god, I don't even... I think this is gonna be it, guys. Oh god. Oh, Jesus! Scare <laughs> Scarecrow works. Where did that thing go? Why is it quieter outside than it is in the house? I'm gonna shut the door. This is gonna be bad. Oh, yeah, let's look up at the... picked up your friend before. Alright, that's probably my van. I don't want to walk through this, man. Okay. Alright, maybe, oh. Walk. Oh, can I walk over here? Alright, it doesn't look like it. Alright, that's fine. I guess I'll walk back to my van. I went through every room in the house. Seen the stupid alien. No, I don't want to look. I don't want to look. <laughs> God damn it! Okay, running, 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 run! When this bastard gets me. Oh, God. I got chills. Jesus Christ. I'm in. Oh. never start in the alien movies. Come on. I don't want to look. I think I'm going for a ride. <laughs> oh, shit. That's a big motherfucker. So demo, in the full game you will find the large territory of Grays, Wood Farm, and a full story of an alien abduction. Add the game to your wish list so you don't miss a discount and release. Sweet! I will definitely be purchasing this game when it comes out. Um, I don't know about you, but that scared the bloody hell out of me. <laughs> Alright guys, so I hope you enjoyed the little demo of They Are Here. Um, I think it's going to be a pretty badass game. This is the first alien abduction game I've ever played before or tested out. Alright, well, you know what to do. If you have already subscribed to my channel, thank you for your support. It's much appreciated. Um, and thank you for tuning in to my live streams. I'm having a lot of fun doing that. Um, I'm also on Twitch, which I 
think is on my channel page on the about. If not, I need to check that out and add it in there. Um, if you haven't subscribed already, please do so and make sure you hit the notifications bell so you get notified anytime I drop something new. I'm working on getting a schedule together of my uh, live streams and um, I'm trying to do every weekend um, at least two or three videos. All right, guys, so if you can, follow me on social media. On Facebook and Instagram, it's Ginger Slaps with a Z, and on Twitter, it's Ginger Six. All right, have a good night.